Then I have a clown garden where I have those clown plants, those dahlias that are just crack me up. And it's just like fun, funky stuff in there. What I love about what Barbara King does is that she can make you a posh garden and she really fits in with anything that's out there. Let's start the show with M65106, the Barb King, Barbara King Statement Butterfly Metal Wall Art. Let's get an idea of the measurements here. It's 17 and three quarter inches by three and three quarter inches by 15 and three quarter inches. So these are large. Clearance price on these, there's no reorder. It's the first day ever at this low price. Three payments of $10.72. The colors are pink, and this is where the wingspan is pink, beautiful bronzing, then some blues and grays, gorgeous veining and coppers. We'll float down here to what we're calling the white. Now where the pink had pink, the white will now have white. Everything else will remain the same. Then we'll push right over there to what we're calling the purple, and it's a, almost like a navy purple. Let's bring Barbara King in. Barbara, you're an amazing woman. You already know how much I admire you. And I wanna thank you so much for being here. Are you at the shop? Are you at the barn? I, I am, I'm at the barn. I'm here with Kyle. Kyle says hi to you too. Hi Kyle. We, hi, Antoinella says hi. <laughs> he says mwah. Oh, they, she has the sweetest kids, you guys. If you don't know her oh, family, she's a good mom. She's got good kids. Barbara, the place oh, no. looks beautiful. You can tell oh. that you are an inspiration. You inspired it all. You walk into that barn. She calls it a barn. That should be a museum. <laughs> it is gorgeous. <laughs> oh my gosh. Oh. Well, thank you. And it has been a wonderful place that we can showcase our plants and many of our QVC products that we have created. And we're so excited to be doing this show with you tonight and showing off first the butterfly. This is just a fun piece of artwork to add a little bit of whimsy. Sometimes we get real serious with our gardening and to add something that's artwork that's as easy as hanging it up, whether it's on a tree or on a wall or maybe right in the middle of a wreath. This is a beautiful piece. It's something that's boutique and elegant and fun. Barbara, I'm going to take one of these off and I'm going to take it over to our front door just for fun. Slide it off. Do you mind? Yes. Okay. So, do. oh, because just to have something different, you know, it's always a wreath, a wreath, a right. wreath. And I like the wreath, but sometimes, you know, especially springtime, I would super love to have something, um, you know, a little bit different up there. I do want to show everyone close up the way that you've made her because she's not going to swing and sway on your door. She's actually right. sitting up about two inches on these posts, these steel posts. Right here is where you're going to hook her into the door. So I'm just going to put her on the door just to kind of get an idea of what that might look like. I think that's super pretty. Oh, I don't, sweet. Can you see it, Barb? I love it. Oh. I love what you did. That is some fun decorating. And that is what we love our customers to do, to take these pieces and just find the places that are the unexpected where your front door, typically we have just a wreath there. Placing this butterfly either with a wreath or on its own is so fun, so pretty, so whimsical, and so detailed. You'll have so much look in this piece from the white, the white has that little patch of blue in it and it has the bronze. And like you said, the posts are actually her legs. So she could actually sit down flat in a garden. So you could put her right into the garden bed too. And it looks like this butterfly had just flown right through the garden and stopped to smell your flowers. I'm gonna do that, Barb. I'm actually gonna do that over here at the front door. Um, again, but I'm not going to do it on the door. I'm going to have to, I'm going to actually take her and work her into these boxwoods. Um, oh, it, she, yeah. she also looks amazing on a tree trunk because you have the brown of the tree trunk and that is another level of the garden that you can decorate and get a visual. Mm -hmm. Love what you did there at the base of the boxwood. That's so fun. Yeah, and it's just because of the way that you've constructed those legs. I've either placed her, play, even brought her up a level where she's right. sitting on the cool. next tier 
Um, uh, yeah, it's just different. It's unique. It's beautiful. But there is a sense, let me just say it this way. Sometimes I go into those gardening stores and I see things that are kind of ridiculous. Your items, Barb, is they're 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 elegant. You know, oh, thank they're, you. they're not jokey, pokey, cheapy, weepy, if that makes sense. They really well, are elegant. I love their chic. Thank you. Yeah. And this butterfly definitely has a gracefulness to her. I mean, even to the very end after you see these little tails coming down and the detail in that is so pretty. It just flows beautifully. These are accent pieces that are going to make your spaces very unusual, but give it such personality that it, it's going to be your happy place. Yeah, I went ahead and I tilted them. We'll have them on the wall and we had Fun. them sitting straight. So now I have them tilted almost like they're a swarm, a little swarm oh, of butterflies. Cool. So now they're all at an angle taking flight up at an angle that what's so fun are you can manipulate these a bit. You can work with them a little sure. bit, but I've never seen it. Look at the ends of them. Oh, look at the little golden balls at the end of them. Right? Oh, geez, the detail, Barb. Oh, uh, thank you. Am I supposed thank to call you. you Barbara or Barb? You know what? I never care what people call me as long as they call me. You're so nice. I, I'm happy. I've I'm going to call you Barbara because Barb. that's what's on here. Usually oh, that's I, very fancy. Well, I don't know what else to do. In real life, I call you Barb, but I don't want to be presumptuous. I okay. like real life. Okay, then Barb it is. <laughs> okay, <laughs> let's, let's move into our next item. I love your smile in that picture. It's so cute. Oh. Okay, these are so adorable. Oh, my gosh. They're 21-inch. Um, these are big. They're 